Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Roxanne and this is my unboxing. Today we are going to be doing the our October Tribe box. So this is the first time I have opened this box. I'm super excited. So just to let you know that Tribe is, I believe, um, I, I believe it's every other month. I'm not 100% sure. It's $34.99 American. It ships for about $6. I think it depends on where you live. You can pick it up from the greater Toronto area. This box here, um, if you follow Lisa at Sincerely LGS, she's a huge fan of this box, so I finally jumped on board. Um, if you use my code below, or even if you use hers, I believe you save 10%, or I know my code just said $5 off the, your first box, so if you use that, you can get this box. I am, I'm not too sure if you're able to customize it. I was able to pick between two palettes, which I will explain when I open it up. Um, this box has six items. I believe it becomes between five and six, all full size from what I I read. But before I get into that, I kind of wanted to tell a funny story um, that happened to me this <laughs> week. So as you know, I'm a huge Look Fantastic cust uh, cust uh, fan. I love the box. Um, actually, there's two kind of funny stories about Look Fantastic. Um, so I started with the subscription um, over a year ago, before I started actually doing my unboxings, um, I used to take pictures of them and post them on my Instagram. Um, so I, I got this wonderful box and I had this really expensive uh, cleanser with a, a muslin cloth. And I was so excited and I opened it up and it just didn't look right. It looked like maybe some of the product had separated. So I emailed, look fantastic. They said, okay, we can offer you a replacement. And then I was like, great, that's what I would like. And then they emailed me back and said, no, we can't, we can give you a, a shop refund. And I was like, well, I'm not buying anything from the shop, so don't do that. Just, I would rather a replacement. I was really looking forward to trying this. And she's like, well, I can offer you a pressure refund. I'm like, look, just send me the replacement. Well, you know, I kind of forgot about it. And then I was going through some emails and I noticed that it was there um, on my Look Fantastic uh, account. And I was like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And how am I still a customer? They didn't send it to me. So anyway, um, I canceled my six month subscription. Um, so I turned off the auto renew and I thought, okay, great, no big deal. Well, the next thing you know, I get two emails and I was like, from them saying something had sent. And I was like, well, I didn't order anything. So I emailed them and I was like, like, you know, what, you, what are you sending me? Like, I didn't order anything. There's nothing in my shop order. And I was like really, really, really hoping that it was the advent calendar and they were like, hey, look, we watch your videos and here's free stuff, which, you know, I was wrong. And my mom messaged me and I was at work. She's like, yeah, your packages are here. I'm like, packages? I thought it was just one coming. And she's like, yeah. So my mom has really shaky hands. So she sent me this picture and it looked like the boxes were like this big, but like they were bigger than the traditional look fantastic box. Yeah. I get home and I see two of these boxes and I'm like well what could be in here and it says hair products I'm like hmm so as you can tell I ripped open to the first one there's the first box I'm like okay so what's in the second box did they send it to me twice no the second box like this had this in it I'm like are you serious you sent it a year later and in two different packages. Okay. Okay. And it frustrated me because I was hoping for a little bit more. But it is what it is. Now with Look Fantastic, it is coming to me hopefully sometime next week. Um, they did have a bit of a hiccup. Some people got an email saying that they weren't supposed to be getting uh, September's box um, at the end of October. And I thought my six month renewal was over so I could start a new subscription. So I signed up for three months because I wanted October's box, but I didn't want to pay full price. I know, right? Doesn't make any sense. Anyway, then I noticed in my bank account that they hadn't taken any money. So I was like, yeah, I'm safe to sign up again. Well, so I signed up. I got a shipping notice the next day. Great. Then I looked at my bank account and they had charged me for my six month. So I have two October boxes coming. Um, I do know that with the subscription if you were already signed up before there was a little bit of a hiccup they are sending out boxes they did send out my second box so i have not one but two boxes coming out so maybe i'll do a giveaway with it i'm not exactly sure i will see but this month october is absolutely great i can't wait to show it to you guys 
So anyway, let's get into Tribe. So like I said, Tribe is not a monthly box, but um, I think a bi-monthly box is what you would call it. Um, yeah, it's so $34.99 American. I didn't check anything else out. I know I did say 10%. So, let's see here. Ooh, there's the palette I just tried. So, um, I was super excited to see this one. Um, now, this I think retails for $45. I'm not sure. Um, I fell in love with the colors and I was so excited to get it. Oh, aren't those beautiful? So I'm really excited to try this. I like that, that it's a multifunctional um, palette. So it does have your um, highlighter. Well, I would assume it's a highlighter anyway. Um, and everything in it. It is such a pretty color. But now I'm seeing it and I'm wondering if it's... Close to, it is a bit different. It is very, yeah, the colors are very different. See, now the aesthetic and the, the um, perspective kind of do look a little like. So, as you know, we got this in boxy a couple months ago. So, there it is. So, those two colors do kind of look alike. I'm going to swatch them both. Definitely different qualities. So, did I just get that on my shirt? Oh, I am such a meaner. Okay, so that is the one from BoxyCharm. And that, uh, so they are different colors. Okay, well that's good. Let's see this purple, ooh, this purple is so pretty, ooh. Trying to pick. I want to try this one. This inspired is going to be so glittery. It's kind of chunky, so you will probably need like a glitter glue with it. Um, let's see what influence is like. Ooh, that's pretty, though you can't really see it on my fair skin. But anyway, so I thought I'd try out this palette. I haven't tried it out. I did try it out tonight. I do like it. Um, I will say that the um, one is awfully chunky. I don't know if that's just my palette or not not as smooth as this one but they are the same brand so anyway so I chose this one now I could have added the other palette which now I can't think of it um, oh now I've got like sparkles all over my hand it's awesome um, oh that's such a pretty pretty color like literally it's everywhere <laughs> uh, anyway <laughs> I'm getting lost. It's Friday night and uh, I'm like, ooh. So you could get, oh, I can't think of the other palette now and that's gonna bug bug me. Um, oh, I need makeup cloths down here. So yes, you could get pick one or two palettes. There was the Suvia one and, oh gosh, I can't think of the other one. And I My brain is seriously not working right now. Um, happy Friday, folks. I should have looked this up, but I was so excited. So anyway, I'm gonna move on to the next item, which is kind of cool. This is um, from Kaylin. Well, there's no cards to say how much this th these things are, but this is like a brush, um, which I really like. I kind of like how skinny it is. Uh, you can fit in your fingers and you wash your um, brushes with so I, lo I love that because you know you can never have too many of these tools I like how small it is um, I think this is uh, something I've been asking for more tools to clean our brushes with because we have so many brushes and I know I have an itsy bag coming and has so many more brushes um, somebody called it the brush so brush or gans or something but uh, anyway yeah so I really like this this is really nice um, I don't know if that I would consider that full size but I mean it's just definitely something I would use and want and that was not part of the spoiler so I was actually really happy I saw that so the next item I actually see is the prime from Mirabella 
so this I didn't exactly see this I, I didn't know that it was in there and I didn't really register um, that it was coming only because the we got the um, the eyeshadow primer and I haven't tried it I actually used the morph morphe morph today and you can see I kind of really like my eyes today um, yeah oh that's actually really really nice so we got the eyeshadow primer in top box and it was kind of chunky so I actually played around with it a little bit more shaked it up shook it up and it seems to have uh, smoothed out so I'm gonna give that a try and I'll actually try this as well this is really really nice I'm actually really surprised by it it's oh it's leaving my skin really soft and like silky and oh, I gotta get this up off my hand because it's really starting to get sparkles everywhere. Uh, like I'm gonna have like sparkles everywhere on me. I should be careful. I'm gonna spray that right into my drink. Okay. Right. So anyway. Yep. Yep. Sparkles are gonna be with me. So as much as I didn't realize that was such a chunky. Thing. So I have to look into using that. I am wearing it in these I'm wearing my work pants stuff. So Those will have to go in the, the wash. Okay, so that's not a bad um, bad item I'm really excited to try that like my hand feels really really s silky. So uh, that's awesome so the next item I didn't know that was in the bag um this was just something that caught my eye. I really like Wonder Beauty, but a lot of times we see the the eye stuff. We, I've never really seen their makeup. I think maybe their, I think I've seen their mascara. Maybe I do have their mascara. I think I do. I haven't tried it yet. So anyway, um, this is nice. I really like this. I like the idea of a double pencil. And that is kind of my color, actually. I'm not gonna sit here and lie to you. I think this is my color. So let me, let me try it on this way. Okay, so that's one end. Ooh, I really like that. Okay, so that's definitely a win for me. I love, love the fact that there's a pencil and there is uh, a lip liner and the lipstick. So this is called um, Lip Setter Dual Lipstick and Liner. So it's on the mauve. So, I mean, perfect color for me. I kind of did my nails Halloweenish earlier this week and they're starting to peel and I didn't have time to do them. But anyway, definitely. So, I mean, that's four things that I really like out of the box. So the one of the last items, so I have two more items, is something I, I don't use really wish I did so this is Vinci Gale cosmetics designed in Canada Woo! so I wonder if so um, I don't know about these these are supposed to be like Halloween lashes so I'm not a big um, lashes a fan so maybe I will uh, put these in my giveaway which people I have started so if you've hung out to with me to the 15 minute mark you were doing awesome so I think I will put this in my thousand uh, giveaway um, I do have that all set up and almost ready to go I'm just putting a few more final touches on it so the last item actually um, I have a bit of a story about um, and I'm super excited to see it in a box um, my mom and I actually watched the Shark Tank and we watched the Dragon's Den and we love those shows. We love the different ideas that come on and we kind of nitpicked our sales pitches and everything else. So anyway, we saw this. Was 
it on Shark Tank? Yeah, Shark Tank, I believe. Um, oh, okay. So, well, that's a little dis disappointing. Um, I, be I thought this was a Canadian-made product. Um, but anyway, uh, it's called No mustache it's 12 hypoallergenic wiping strips for the face portable hair removing kit it includes post wax aloe cream so we thought this was a great idea this isn't something you see every uh all the time i can see there's the cream there it says um i think i would imagine that you would uh okay so these are Oh, there's the instruction. So anyway, so we thought this neat, this idea was neat and we were all on board and then they were talking about making it into a um, multi, um, you know, merchandising campaign and it was really interesting. So anyway, this is what really drove me to it. Um, so it says here, cleans air where hair is to be removed, rub strip between your hands for 10 seconds, pull strip apart. Um, place one half of the strip firmly on the side of your lip and press in the direction of hair growth. Rub the strip repeatedly in this direction. Holding the skin taunt, quickly pull the strip in opposite direction of hair growth. For post wax treatment, apply the aloe cream provided for calming effects. So this is great for people who have mustache. I do not have a mustache, but I will be using these. I put the lid down now. I don't know where the lid, oh, there it is. I will be using these, um, maybe, I might actually even try them on my eyebrows or something. So I'm, sorry, my son just came home. I didn't know he was out, so, but anyway, um, these retail, I believe, for $14, and I'm not sure if that's, uh, that must be American. So um, it, it, it is pretty interesting. Um, it's not a product that you do see every day in beauty boxes, which I really do love. And the same as this. This is something you don't actually see in beauty boxes all the time. All the other products you can see um, that come in a variety of boxes. So anyway, um, I'm going to um, end the video here. If you are interested in this box, I believe it's still available. So go ahead, use the link, sign up. The box should ship out pretty quick for you. Um, again, if you're in the GTA, there is information on how to uh, pick it up. Uh, the, again, the box is $34.99 um, plus shipping. If you have any questions or if you like this box, let me know what you think of it. Um, which product, you know, is yours. Now, if I can think of the other. <laughs> it is. An, there's another um, eyeshadow palette. And you could have actually added it on for $20. I believe the palettes were $30, $35. And this is all American prices. Um, which was really nice, like, cause, um, everybody seems to be doing with add-ons and they caught on pretty quick with customizations and add-ons. So I'm super excited to see the box. I'm super excited to have it. Um, I am excited to see what next month brings. I'm not sure if I'm going to stay or not. So, uh, yeah. So anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great night and take care.